Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Misty Hino with Misty Hino's Lego Robotics. Today's video, I have a Spike Prime Scissors Lift. Now I'm gonna go ahead and give you a couple of preloaded statements. Number one, this is not my build. I got this off of a YouTube video. They did not have building instructions, so I basically copied, you know, I paused the video and copied what the person did. The other issue is um, they claim that it's supposed to be from the Spike Prime kit, although the Spike Prime kit only has four of these 11 beams, so I had to use some EV3 beams. So please don't start building this until you have those extra 11. You're going to need extra, uh, four of them. But I'm going to go ahead and show you how I built this and definitely see how much weight can these motors push up? So stay with me. He now Lego Robotics. Okay, so I don't want to act like I'm frustrated, um, but they claim to have the building instructions and there weren't any building instructions. So I'm going to be giving that to you guys. And also today, I thought it would be fun to see how much this thing can carry. So I'm going to go ahead and start loading this thing on and I will definitely show you step by step how I built this thing. And I'll even show you the program that I can use my touch sensor to lift it up and to lower it. Okay, so I have my touch sensor here. I can raise it, lower it. And this is the part that once I get things to, you know, get loaded on here, it'll stay like that, but lift. Lower. Ah, that bugs me. And let's see how high this can actually go. And then definitely those gears are the your racks. That is so satisfying. Let's go ahead and start loading this thing up. Okay, if you guys did not know, I am a total Hot Wheels lover. So let's see if this thing can lift a Hot Wheel. Oh yeah, not even a problem. All right, let's go to something heavier. All right, we have a pair of scissors. And not a problem. Lifting that thing like a champ. Look at that. I guess it needs more weight. Okay, we have my phone on here. Yeah, I'm recording with my new one, putting my old one on here. Now, I don't want to drop it too low because if I do, that happens. It just gets a little, I don't know, wonky and it goes, goes down. Let me put that back up again. I'm getting nervous. I'm, I know I'm at the threshold of the capacity for this to, to lift. I'm scared. Okay, we're going to consider this a success because it is lifting it. If it was too heavy, it would push this down like before. I just can't get to the point where it, it goes past the... Okay, now we have a stapler on here. I'm not going to go down too far. Hey, not bad. It's definitely lifting it. Oh, you can hear those gears grinding. Struggling, but it's definitely lifting this stapler. Ooh. Okay, let me get something else on here. 
Okay, I got crazy and put this little mini water bottle on here. This thing's heavy. I'm not going to go down too far. Let's see how it does. I am shocked. Oh, oh, no. Okay. I saw it lifted up a little bit. I, I don't know. I don't know if we're going to call that a success or not. Okay, just the mere fact that it's holding that up is pretty good. I'm going to go down just a little bit. Back up. Ooh. Down, back up. I don't know. That seems like a success to me. Down, up. Go down a little bit more. Back up. Oh. Down. I don't know. That seemed really good, you know. Okay guys, so hopefully you enjoy the spike prime scissors lift. I hope all the directions were somewhat okay. I was actually taking the pictures as I was taking it apart. So hopefully everything was clear and hopefully you can have fun with your spike prime scissors lift. Okay guys, thank you so much for watching. I am Mr. Hino from Missiles Lego Robotics. I'm out. He's out. He's out. We got this. We got this. We got this, guys. Hey guys, Mr. Hino here. Thank you so much for watching. And if you love robotics, don't forget to check out these videos also because they're cool. Okay, guys, take care.